how to create a jump link in Thrive Themes. Now, if you've been on the internet a while, you may also refer to this as an anchor link. And the beauty of this is it allows you to spread out the information on your page without someone having to go to a new page of your website, they will see different information. So on this example, I just don't want the page to be cluttered with too much information. I want people to follow things through one step at a time and just click when they've completed each step rather than seeing everything all together on their screen. So I want this link here that says click here to start to jump to another part of the page which is just down here which is step one. So let me first show you the old way of doing it and then I'll show you the new dynamic uh, scrolling link um, but let's have a look at the, the old way first of all. So this is the text I want to go and where do I want to go it, where do I want it to go to? I want it to go to this background selection here. So I select the background and what I want to do is go to HTML attributes and in ID I'm going to type step one. Doesn't matter what you call that, just put that and that's your ID for this area, this background section. So that's where I want it to jump to. So let's now go and select this text again and I go to my hyperlink and I want to have this to go to and I just simply put the hash or the pound sign and then step one and I simply click insert. Now that has now created us an instant jump. Now let me just quickly go and demonstrate that to you and show you what it looks like on the live page. This doesn't have a scroll, it will just go straight from and it, it will look to the user as if he's gone to a new page because I've got so little on this page. If I click here you'll see it goes straight through further down to the page but it was an instant jump rather than a scroll. So let me now show you how to make this a scrolling um, link as well. So let me just go back to edit with Thrive Architect. So again what I'm going to do is I'm going to change this click link here. So let's just highlight this text and I'm going to go to the hyperlink and you can see here it's now actually suggesting do I want this to be a jump link. Uh, so if this is the first time you've done it you're just uh, hyperlinking the text select jump link rather than static. Now I'm going to delete the target that's currently going for that um, and we're just going to select that again. That's just to show I'm not cheating by using the old jump link. So we now go back to jump link and I want to select target. Now that allows me to select anywhere on the page as the target. So again I'm going to select the background selection. You can see it's dotted in red now. It selected the background and we need to click on the add jump link. So this is where that link is going to jump to. But this one is now a scrolling link. Let me just quickly go and show you what that looks like on the real page and you'll see this looks really nice, very professional, very smart. So we're going to click on this link here and you'll see it scrolls up the page to reveal this part of the page. Hope you found that useful. My name is Paul Hardingham from paulhardingham.com. Please give me the thumbs up if you, if you found this useful. Do also comment on the YouTube channel and subscribe if you'd like further updates just like this. Thanks for watching.